everyone, this is Cold Run back with Sekiro Shadows Die Twice, and I am in, I'm just uh, up for, um, I was just in the mood for another short session today, so probably another, th I aim for this to be about 30, 30, 40 minutes, something like that, uh, regardless of whether I meet a boss or I'm dying to a boss or encounter nothing at all. Um, yeah, I just, I don't know, I've been having a hankering to play and I really have been having a lot of fun with this game. So, yeah, let's get started. We got a wall we can hug here. I don't remember which direction I came from to find this. I think I came from back here. No, I think I did not come from back there. I don't know where I came from. But I do know I'm digging the hell out of this music. Okay, so I did not come from there. So my friend Rack told me, um, I had a, a good tip uh, from seeing an earlier part of the playthrough, which is that I wasn't really using the vertical, whoa, I wasn't really using the vertical parts of this well, and so I'm going to try to do that a little bit better. Let's see, there's a lot of dudes there. Yeah, so there's a lot of dudes there, and it seems that the fire is kind of a, just a wall. So I, I can't really go beyond that. Um, anyone down there? Other people or whatnot? Nope. So let me back off a bit, because I, I see the archers around the corner. And I just mistimed that. I was I meant to jump. Oh, yeah, a lot of archers there. Hopefully it'll come to me. Come on, friends. Yeah, this is where I'd like them to fight me. That was almost an unintentional Makiri counter. I wish I could take... Oh, I hit level 4. I hit um, 4 skill points. Because again, I think that's gonna ah that friggin' thing. Might as well use this. No. Okay, so I can go up there if I want to. I don't know if I want to though. I guess why wouldn't I want to? To be really careful with this fire. Does that sound mean I've been spotted? I can't remember. Yeah, that meant sound means I've been spotted. take a lot of comfort that I hit the fourth thing because, whoop, I didn't mean to do that. Um, I don't want to do it. I don't know which, which I want to use. But there's some houses here I can enter, so let's check some of these out. Cannot enter that. But I can eavesdrop there, can't I? Does that mean I can eavesdrop? Maybe I can eavesdrop from inside. Is that what you I actually don't remember what the... Oh, no, that's the Sculptor's Idol. That's the Sculptor's Idol. Okay, so... What's in here? No, whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, buddy. 
I pressed the wrong button for the Makiri counter. I'm definitely on the verge of death here. That's okay. Again, my I. Oh. <laughs> Who's attacking me? Where are you from? Who's attacking me? Oh, you. I can't see anything. I have no idea where I am. That scared the hell out of me. Oh, cool. I can break it open. So again, I think this is the sculptor's idol sign. Yeah, that's what I'm pretty sure that's what it is. But it's nice that you can tell through the walls when there's a sculptor's idol there. Divine confetti. Confetti imbued with divine blessing made for driving away apparitions. Paper is made ceremoniously whereby pulp is spread thin using water from the exalted fountainhead. As the gods bless the water, so too will the confetti bless one who basks in its touch, allowing attacks to connect with apparition types. So unless I use this, I won't be able to attack ghosts. That's... well, is our ghosts coming up? That's also good to know, because I'll just try to run away if I don't have that available. <laughs> I don't know whether I want to put it on here or not. Um, I, I kind of don't want to put it on there, because I'm afraid I'll accidentally use it, and it seems really precious. So what's in here? People? No, I don't see people there. They'll be super secret just in case. Whew, that was a thing. So this is someone from the Harada estate who's just taken out, I guess. Yeah, I have no health. I mean, it seems like it would be smart to just go back. Wait, don't I have an item that lets me do that? Or an ability or something? Um, inventory. Homeward Idol. Return to the last... Right, I forgot about... I forgot all about this. I forgot all about this. And I, I'm... I, as part of the reason I forgot about it is because in prior... Soulsborn games, if you use this this thing, you lose all your souls. You lose all your ex coins and experience. Um, it is no different than death. Here, it might be different than death. Um, I actually do want to put that on a... Homeward Isle, I do want to put that on the... Uh, yeah. I'm going to add that here. Oh, be careful, Andrew. Okay, so there's a little open area here. This feels like a trap. This feels very much like a trap. Let's spring the trap. Ceramic shard. Okay, I, I see something on that side. I see something I can, I can spring to on the other side, but I want to finish exploring on this side first. Been through here. Is there anywhere else up top I can go? I don't think so. That looks. I don't want to touch that because I'm probably going to burn to death. I'm trying to be a sneaky beaver here. It's down below. Nothing. Okay. Wait, can I get through the stairs to that area? No, it doesn't look like it. Not from that angle, at least. Whoa, scared myself there. Okay. 
so I don't think I can get into there. And then it's just burning. It smells like burning. Yeah, and I, I've seen enough. I've, I've touched the burning enough that I don't want to mess with it. Okay. So first, let's check out this area. I'm going to try to be, again, sneak around a little bit. get under the floorboards here. I don't remember how to get under the floorboards, if there's a button for that. This is such a big area, and I haven't seen a boss in a while. Like, I know I've seen some mini things, but nothing. no actual bosses. Okay, this feels like where I get off the death train. okay if you came down here. Okay, well, I cheesed that one out. Light coin purse. Oh, there's some people in the middle there. I think I want... Do I want to use a... Uh, yeah, I'll use a pellet. I think this is almost better than on boss on some boss fights. Every boss fight except the final run of a boss fight. Because this lets me explore more and learn more. Okay, being a little sneaky beaver here. Sneak up from behind there? Maybe. Yeah, this seems like the way to go instead of going on head, head, head on. Here's the drunkard. Uh oh. Oh god. This is I. This is not what I intended. This was a mistake. Many mistakes were made. Oh god, it's the guy from the trailer. Many mistakes were made. I made so many mistakes, I can't... Uh, oh god. Hey. Uh, how do I amend my mistakes and undo my mistakes? Do I homeward idle? Nope, you're seeing me. Dilapidated shrine, let's do it. Oh, oh I actually, I forgot I had two resurrections. That was a mistake. I got... So do I have to take out all the little ads before I can do Juzo himself, I wonder? Maybe. It certainly seems, certainly looked like it. And there's one more thing I want to check before we move on to Juzo, which is, I checked the left of the bridge, I didn't check the right of the bridge. Um, the left was where I went to the cemetery, the right, I want to check, check again. So, this might be a nothing, but it's something I want to check out anyway. I wanted to make sure I didn't miss something. Oh, I didn't miss anything. There's just, there's nothing there. That's all I was checking out. Yeah, so this I have less to lose now. So can I go sneaky mode? I cannot, they saw me. So I'm sneaking, I'm hiding. Will that make them go away? Doesn't seem like it. He's keeping up his aggro. No, he's lowering it. I 
might have to just fight them each time, but I hope I don't. hope there's another way to, to do this. I'm waiting for the yellow triangle to lose his Dorito. Come on, friend, lose your Dorito. Lose your Dorito, lose your Dorito. Wait, why can't they see it anymore? No, he sees me. No, it looks like I'm really gonna have to fight him each time, which is not great. Really? I'm gonna have to do this each time? No, I'm gonna try to run past him. I don't think this is gonna work, but again, I don't have a lot to lose at this point. So we'll see how this goes. So I just jumped into stealth. Will that work? Sure doesn't look like it's working. Oh, it did not work. Can I jump up somewhere? No, there's no safety there. But there is safety here. Yeah, this I'm... Gonna attack me, buddy? So that might be the way. Maybe that's the way. Because it's. And I really don't want to have to fight him all each time. Let their Doritos go away. Go away, Dorito. That's me in the classroom, losing my Dorito. I think there's got to be a better way than what I'm doing. There's got to be. But it's the way I'm seeing right now. So I'm definitely concerned about Juzo the Drunk. Because I think he's going to be... I think, does he just trigger automatically as soon as I hit any of these guys? I think he might, which is bad. There's a lot of these guys. Got to be an easier way around this. I mean, I could take out one with a... And look, I saw a, um... Yeah. I'm switching to an axe, because I saw something. I saw one with a shield, a couple with a shield. Yeah, there's Juzo. He's sitting in the thing. Anywhere I can jump up to? I don't think so. Maybe can a ledge hang? Again, it didn't look like it. Unless I can do that. does not look like it. Can I get inside to Juzo? That sounded dirty. Can I, I can't get inside Juzo. Um, no, that's all burning. This is not, though.
No, that's an invisible wall. This feels like something. This definitely feels like something, especially because there's that treasure there. I'm gonna jump off this tree. Is there anything that hugging the walls can tell me? Because again, there's clearly a thing here. This is clearly a thing. Is this a secret area? No. I really want to get that. Because it's... Oh, that's a thing. It's right there. It's begging me to take it. I'll get to this later. If I'm missing it, if it's something obvious, then, you know, I apologize. But not really. Okay, we'll try this the head-on method. We'll try the direct method. So what does the direct method involve here? What's the best way to approach this? I can k take out one guy, but then I'm right next to Juzo when he wakes up. <sighs> but I think it's still better than all the other options, because at least I, at least then I have one guy I take out. There he is. Hello, friend. Holy lord. Oh, is there someone around me? Oh, yes, there is. I have no idea how I'm supposed to even remotely be able to do this. Is there a place I can channel them into? Can I funnel them somewhere? I don't think I want to be in a small area with Juzo. Nope, no, I don't want that. So is this the right way? This feels like not the right way. Yeah, Juzo's coming after me. He's staying with his buddy. He's staying with his fire-breathing buddy. Oh, shit, he's poisoning... Shoot, he's poisoning his thing. Alright, come after me. At least I'm alone with this guy before I, so I can die in peace. So is that really it? Okay. Do I have to parry this... Oh god, that seems bad. It seems really bad. What do you do? Oh god! So he poisons me. <sighs> Is there anywhere I can jump up to? Can I uh, do the thing I was supposed to do against the first boss? Or do I just have to learn and deflect? Can I run past him? Can I run away? Nope, I can't. It's a smoke wall. Okay, so he draws back, I can jump over at. Nope, he's doing a double slash there. Wow, that's really tough. Do I really have to fight through all of his ads each time? Like, the tough part of this should be the boss himself. I mean, I guess not. I guess the tough part is they're saying you have these seven guys and figure out how you can deal with them each time. It's just not the tough part. I enjoy it because I've dealt with a lot of guys before. Um, that sounded again dirty, but whatever. 
Is there another? Oh, there's another shield guy there. Second potion here, second gourd. Oh, don't go in back to him. Poison breath. Okay. This is, again, this is not. This feels like I'm running around like a chicken without a head. Oh god, there you are! Oh, damn it! No, back out, back out. Okay. So what do you do? I mean, I don't have, I have so little health enough to deal with you. Let me use one for the sake of learning how to fight you. So you're going to poison your blade. Can I parry you? No, you do that, and then what else? It's a very cool boss design. Okay, the axe kick. That's bad for me. Maybe that's when I hit him, when he's drinking. Maybe that's when I hit him, too. a really long range, so I want to be very careful. Okay, I can hit him a little bit there. I don't want to necessarily hit him there either. Nope, that was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. Use my second pellet. Mostly because I feel like it's best used on these learning encounters. So that's real death. Okay. So I remember seeing in the... I'm going to try one more tonight, and then I'll call it. Um, I remember seeing in the trailer that the person who was fighting him was parrying him, was deflecting him. So maybe I just have to learn how to do that. I just have to watch his fights and learn how to deflect this guy. Okay, that wasn't too bad. You're gonna spit poison at me? Yeah, it looks like you're about to spit poison at me. Which is not a great place to be. So that's a grab, I can sidestep that. That's a jump. I can I mean it's a swipe, I can jump that. That's something I don't want any part of. Breathing poison. Breathing poison. And I especially think I'm going to have to deflect him because he just has too much health. 
to charge. I can jump. Okay. This blade is poison at this point. So grab that, I can dodge. That I can sidestep, rather. The hug attack is supposed to sidestep and the hammer. Giving as in if I miss that, I, I don't know if I how I recover. I'm getting him, I'm chunking him down, so maybe I should play it safe. Is that the way? That's two attacks. Second. Nope. That's a jump over. When he pulls back and low, that's a jump over. And that's when I can punch him also. Go for that, but I'm afraid he'll do a second one. Oh, I ran into it. I ran into it. That was my bad. And he's got a whole second form after this. Oh, God. Oh, I had that. Too far away. Drink seems when I should go in for him. That seems when I should go in for him too. I seem I f I f I'm fine find safe zones. No, no, back out, back out, back out, back out, back the hell out. Eat a pellet. Attack, okay. 
Super lucky there, super lucky. Okay, one down. And I get, a, I get one back. I, could, I feel bad to keep playing it safe like this, but I mean, if it's working, that's sort of working. Nope. I <laughs> I hit against a rock. Nope. 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 Back out. Oh shoot! That third swing I wasn't expecting. No, no. One. Oh, I thought I was out far enough. I really want to do this again, but I gotta get to sleep. I'm glad I didn't get super frustrated at that fight. It was easy to do so, but at least I was dealing with that a little bit better. Anyways, uh, that's it for me. Have a good night.